Hello everybody and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey where undying optimism is the name of the game and we're gonna look at this spear that I can't use yet so it stops blinking at me spear 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 cool ooh that would be nice oh shoot I could what this whole time oh wait was I using a spear I think I was yeah, it was. It was a level 29 spear. Oh, but I leveled, that's right, I leveled up to level 33, and I hadn't really noticed. Cool. Now, what, what does this give us? 12 adrenaline per hit, and... Whoa, 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 I can use this one, too? Okay, what is this? 100 damage adrenaline on headshot kill, damage with other power abilities. Ooh, I like that. I like that one. All right, okay, uh, I did pick these on purpose because they have a really nice damage attacking from behind perk. Uh, the helmet, that's right, the helmet's with the person who's level 40 freaking five. Anyway, all right, the Pancreon Organizer, wait, no, map is in Elise Ellis uh, which is didn't we what didn't we look oh wait where am I where am I where is me okay all right okay here we go they are in the center of the valley of Olympia probably right around here that looks like an altar of Zeus so yeah probably where this merc is. Yikes. That's a yikes for me, dog. Alright. Let's ride on over. I, Ooh. turns out I have office Hello. work to do today. Well, I mean, they just contacted me and they were like, yo, you want some office work? And I was like, yeah, I, I love money. Please, let me have it. But I was like, first I got some things to do, very important errands to run, you know, like doing the Olympics, S signing up for the Olympics at least. Anyway, this is going to take a while, so I'll see you guys on the other side. Whoa, so I just, I stopped to synchronize the point at the Temple of Apollo, but this is the Temple of Hades. Think. Or is it this? I don't think it's that. I don't think Hades. Hades, I think, generally didn't get like a lot of like grandiose things. I think. Because people, I mean, you respect death, but it's like you know, it's you're, it's like scary. I think this is. Where did it say? Or is it? Was it this? This is the Temple of Hades. Oh shoot! Whoa! 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 whoa. Hey, look! I just wanted to look, man. I just wanted to look. I just wanted to look at the Temple of Hades. Hades is one of my favorite gods. He's cool. Hades like very rarely does anything wrong. Like as far as I remember in the lore, is like not like his brothers who like rape everybody they can get their hands on. You know. Uh, I mean, he had the whole Persephone thing, but the Hades Persephone myth is actually one of my favorites. Like, I love the retellings of it, where it's like, you know, they actually, like, I don't know, like, fell in love mutually? I don't know. Like, there's always really, I mean, you could see it as, like, a, a really bad story, too, but I think it's kind of got similarities to, like, Beauty and the Beast, sort of, and that's a cla that's always a classic, I mean... There's things wrong with it, but there are things that you can write that make it really cool, too. And I really like it, where it's like Persephone and Hades, like, are on, like, equal footing. And I'm pretty sure she's actually one of the more powerful goddesses when she's down there. Um, with him. Like, and it's just so, in like, there is, like, such a dichotomy. I think that's another thing that's really interesting about it, is that, like, she's the goddess of, a, a goddess of spring. And he's, like, the god of the underworld. But he's not just the god of death. He's also the god of, like, gemstones and, like, minerals and mining. Like, the underground. He's the god of the underground. So, I've, I've heard interpretations that, like, his palace would actually be one of the most beautiful. You know, because it's, like, full of, like, like ore veins and, like, minerals and, and gems. And, 
beautiful things. So anyway, he's actually he's one of my favorites just because he's like the least rapey out of everybody. <laughs> and I really like Persephone and Hades retellings because I feel like they they can be like she has a certain amount of power over him and like he does over her as well but like then in, in the end they can like sort of like come together and like balance it out and like see past each other's differences and like fall in love anyway that's my ideal love story ha 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 <laughs> but anyway let's uh just keep riding away oh this is cool <laughs> it's just a centaur statue in the middle of the water. Polus? I bet you Polus was a uh, centaur. Anyway, I couldn't get to the... Apparently it was like, you cannot get to this location via this road. I was like, alright, we're off-roading. I try to take the roads. It doesn't work. Oh, excuse me. Excuse oh, I'm so sorry. Just ran right through your camp. Oh. Okay, there's an Olympic truce, so do not do illegal things. Okie dokie. I will, I will not. I generally don't, but I, I will do work even harder. What? I wonder if it'll let me get that fast travel point first. Excuse me, excuse me. Or wait. Bar Barnabas? What? Okay, the fast travel point is further away than I thought. What the? What? What? Welcome to the Olympics! Breathing! Ah, can you not taste the excitement in the air? Are you going to be like this the whole time we're here? <laughs> By the gods, yes! I'll try and win quickly then. Come now, you must be feeling something. <laughs> I'm just having fun with you. Who wouldn't be impressed? It is a place of immortal glory. You can be sure Ira and Zeus will be watching your performance closely. Well, two of oh, my least favorite, no pressure, least favorite uh, people. Forget that for the moment, and let's enjoy the sights and see what Olympia has to offer. Okay. We're just... Oh, okay, I did talk to Barnabas. Isn't this magnificent? It's certainly impressive. We just oh, walked through I'm there. I'm sad we'll be missing the chariot races. Oh, what I would have given to see that. We should take in the sights and praise the gods to be here at such a time. Which sights should we see? There are so many. <laughs> He's so excited. The uh, Temple of Zeus, the Altar of Zeus, and, uh, of course, the Olympic tree. Uh... Tree. I'd like to see the Olympic tree. Okay. Wait, why are you guys... The, it, there's an Olympic truce. Why are you guys fighting? Uh, that's not allowed. That is very not allowed. You should be ashamed of yourselves. Found the Temple of Zeus. The Translucent. Interesting name. So many quests here. Olympia would be cool, though. I'm excited. This is the Olympic tree. Okay. There's so much to do. Jeez, like all those quests popping up. I was like, Jesus freaking leave. Come on, game. You can do it. I believe. For Olympia. You brought me to see a tree? Not just any tree. This is the sacred tree from which the winner's cotinos are made. I'd rather have Drachmi than the wreath. Ah. A Cotinos is no ordinary wreath. The olive branches are harvested by children and taken to the temple of Ira. There, the Helenodike, or judges, make the wreaths. I guess they'll be lighter to carry back to Sparta than gold. <laughs> At least you see the practicality, if not the wonder of the Olympic <laughs> Okay, I guess we're just gonna be like... We, we couldn't just walk together? We should make an offering to Zeus for good luck in the games. Why Why are we doing it this way? This feels weird. I should read uh, on the map. You can, you can turn... Uh, there's like a map overlay where you can... Like, look at all this stuff. Oh, uh, here's all of the gods and goddesses. This Poseidon. 
Artemis, and that was Athena. I don't know who that is. That's probably Zeus. That's probably Hera. That, I don't know. No, that's Zeus. Uh, I don't know. That's cool. I don't, you don't usually, usually it's like a temple and you see like depictions of the one god or goddess. But yeah, on this one, they were all, I mean, it makes sense to be here, but you know, it was cool. Everybody's having a party. I guess they're doing it like this so that you can like go do other things if you want. To think I would see such an offering to the gods in Olympia itself. Yeah. I've never seen anything like this. And this is nothing. On the final day, the Magiros will slaughter a hundred bulls for the Hecatomb to honor Zeus. Wow. I could eat. But that's not for people like us. We What's wrong with people like us? Uh, I can pay it. But also, like, basically, it's just, like, they, they sacrificed the animals, and it was sort of a practical thing, too. It was, like, a treat for everybody, because I'm pretty sure, like, a lot of, like, everybody, or at least a lot of people who were at the celebrations would get the meat, and they would basically burn, like, the entrails and stuff like that, because it was, like, or they would, it was basically, like, cooking it, and then the people would get the meat. Uh, because the gods only feasted on the essence or the smoke of the offering, and then the people could eat what was left. My friend here would like to savor your offering. I have the drachmi. Who won't say no to some extra drachmi? Who won't say no? Mm, delicious. Thank you, my friend. Gladly. I know how much this all means to you. Well, then, I think we have spent enough time here. Agreed. Let's go. Okay. We're in Olympia. It's only fitting we visit the Temple of Zeus. Well, first, like, wow. Look at all this, like, all these ashes. Like, whoa. This, I mean, maybe you guys should clean off the, the altar a little bit. Because that's yucky. See, like, I think these are, like, piles of, like, the skins that you can use. Or that you can have or something. I don't, I'm not quite sure. I, I know I'm close to an untracked target, but I'm busy with this one. <sighs> what do you want from me? I need to talk to him. No, you don't. We need to finish having a tourist, a tourist escapade. Oh, okay. It's right here. Okay. I was, I'm like, I was like, I'm not going to climb the walls because that's probably rude, but I, I am going to climb the walls. Also, I can synchronize the location when I'm done. Man, the stuff that they built was on such a massive scale. It's crazy. I mean, it's like Egypt, too, right? Where it's just like everything is built on such a massive scale. It's crazy. I mean, but it has to be to be this big. Like, you have to have, like, these huge pillars and everything. Oh, wow! This is really cool! This is actually really cool. And, like, they've got it all done up with, like, banners and wreaths. This is probably the nicest temple I've seen. Have we even seen a temple to Zeus yet? I'm sure, we've, I'm sure we've seen shrines. But this reminds me of the Disney movie Hercules. This is very cool. Unbelievable oh, craftsmanship. Sorry. Much better than the statue. Oh, yeah! <laughs> the one that's on the hillside that we climb up for our first synchronization point. one of the wonders of the world. And... Sculpted by your friend, Phidias. I'd hardly say friend. Even acquaintance might be pushing it. Can't you just feel the presence of Zeus and Ida when you stand here? I thought it was the wind. Huh. Don't mock the gods! I'm sorry. I don't want my feelings to cast a shadow on your day. Don't think yourself as tortured by the gods, but as molded for greatness by their hands. I am molded by no one's hands. If the gods know me, they watch in silence. Oh. Uh, come, let's leave this place. Fortunately for you, I have enough faith for the both of us. I thought she might not be. I thought maybe she would be kind of jokey about it, but like, actually like, 
maybe have a little bit of belief, but I think she's one of those people that doesn't really believe. But there might be a little part of her that at some point could believe if she wanted to. Like, if she saw something definitive. But I think for the most... But I don't know. She Sometimes she'll say, like, things like, by the gods, but it's like, you know, that's just kind of, like, offhand. You one know? of us. Yes? Thank you for this. I hope I wasn't too much of a distraction. No, it was made better by your company. All right, a buddy. A flock of harpies couldn't dampen my spirits. We are at the Olympics. He's incorrigible. You're competing, and I believe you'll win. Then I will, because you have a lot of belief. <laughs> he's He's got enough belief for the both of us, that's for sure. I actually noticed I could... Uh, loot, basically, the temple. Oh, Olympic gymna Gymnasium. Whoa. Oh! Everybody's training. Cool. Open air gymnasium. Everything, we got, we got these beautiful purple banners up everywhere. It's really nice. I think it's really pretty. But I wanted to go loot Zeus's horde as long as it was okay. Oh, the, I think it's the this fast travel point. Yeah. I have to get the fast travel point anyway. There's so many things to do. Like, why are there so... I mean, it's kind of nice. I kind of... I'm, I'm, I'm glad they put a lot of effort into the Olympic area. That's cool. How do you even get up these steps? Like, well, I guess there are... Like, this is not the side you're supposed to get up. You're supposed to get up on the other side. But still... Human-sized steps, please. It's all about that, like, perfect geometry, essentially. Alright. It's not stealing, right? Thank you. I was actually hoping for, like, armor. But, you know, thanks anyway. That was bad. Oh, I feel so. Oh my gosh, I feel I feel like I've just desecrated the, tem the, the temple. I shouldn't have done that. I thought it was gonna be items. I don't really care about money. Ooh, they've really done like a ton of work on this. I don't think. I think that's not Medusa. I think that's a monster, like a, another monster, I guess. They have the victory wreaths and the olive branches. Is this not the... Oh my gosh, it's gonna be the other side, isn't it? Right? Yeah, okay, it's weird to me that like when you get close, it doesn't, like you, you, get, you get within a certain distance and the little marker kind of goes away. And then you, then you have to get close enough again. Like you see it from a distance and then you get closer and it's like disappears and you get close enough and it shows up again. I don't know what's up with that. It's a little weird. Ooh, there's the, like, uh, arena. Wow. Very cool. Temple of Dreams. Alright, I should probably go talk to the person. The rest of these are things that I can do, but... I think they are over here? No. Nope. Nope. Where'd you go, person? Oh no. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I thought they were gonna be marked on my map. Unless I, unless I just read the names wrong. Oh, that's a really pretty, like, di diadem she's got on. Diadem? Diadem? Words? I really like this place. It's really pretty. And, like, people are partying everywhere. I noticed on the roads, too, that the roads were actually a lot busier than they normally are. I kept running people over. Yo, what up? <laughs> Stadium. I'm here for the Pancration. You must be joking. The only fighter we're missing is Testicles. Um, 
replacing him. He's a little under the water. <laughs> I mean, weather. I'm the one taking his place. Okay, okay. Save it for the fight. <laughs> Thanks. This is unprecedented. But the crowd will riot if the Pankration is cancelled. Very well. The competition begins shortly. Oh, geez. I'm not ready. I need to do something first. But I'll be back. <laughs> Bring your courage with you. Okay. Erebus swallows another day. Erebus. Nice. I... I don't know if I want to, like, do a couple of these other things. Like, will they, will they go away if I fight in the Pankration? I have a feeling things could go fairly poorly for me. You know what I mean? Uh, where is this? There we are. Wow. Oh, wow. She's beautiful. She's got beautiful eyes. She would recount the tale of meeting Medusa. She immediately fled, though not before stealing a circlet as a trophy. She insisted it turned her invisible and warm, which, of course, no one saw. Oh, wow. A 20% chance to ignore half damage. This helmet doesn't make its wearer disappear, but it does make them more confident with the blade. All right. I do, I do like some of those. They look very cool. I need to go buy some ancient tablets if I want to upgrade my ship. Actually, I was gonna probably just change the Spartans. Well, no, we'll leave the Spartans for now. I was gonna maybe change it, but... Let's see, what do we have that looks interesting? And does Drachme of Romance, Gutter Runner, Message Stick in the Artist, Throwing the Bet, Calipateria. Let's go look at this one really quick. What? This one. Drachme of Romance. It's been a while since we've romanced anybody, although probably we won't, because <laughs> it sounds like we will. Temple of Hiera. Cool. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, so that was Hera on the end of the line on that one thing. She has this, like, staff. Neat. She looks very nice. It's a very small temple, but a modest, a modest, a modest temple. That looks nice. What's this? Pel Pelopion. Pelopion. What does that what does that mean? What does it do? Tell me. <laughs> I can just look at the map. Even you could sing so uh -oh. long like a with me. Uh -oh. I should break your neck for this. Uh oh. That's right. Show your true colors. You Thorians are nothing but thugs. What? Why you Ionian? Please. Stay calm. Herodotus. Remember the truth. Ah, uh, it's just like a bunch of philosophers. <gasps> Cassandra, please. If these fools break the truth, thief! You're on to talk, you double dealing dog! Nobody wants trouble here. You know what will happen to you both if you break the truce. Now, if someone can tell me what's going on, I can this solve everything. This girl stole from me. Huh. You call me a thief? You're the thief. Enough! I'll ask the questions. Herodotus, what's all this about? This scum robbed me. I didn't. Your name is a Herodotus. Scum. I am from an honorable family. Only a lowly Ionian would steal. I said Herodotus. Uh, yes. It seems both their treasuries were breached, and their valuables stolen. If there's been a theft, why do you suspect each other? Because this... It's a matter of blood. Makar is from an eminent Vorian line. Mighty warriors, but rather austere. While Lelech is from Ionian stock. A grand tradition of artists and philosophers. You mean philanderers! Both sides are important. Uh -huh. Spoken like a true Ionian. It seems unlikely they would rob each other at the same time. You have to find out who stole their drachmi. I can't believe they would do this to each other. Whatever their issues, they've always respected the Olympia. <laughs> Did you? I'll find out what happened and protect the truce. Protect it with my it, life. Makar, I will reward you well. As will I, if you bring me evidence of Lelech's double dealing. And what if it's neither of you? 
Then they will both reward. Ooh. Very well. Agree. Nice, 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 nice. All right, I like it. I like it. Drag me of romance. Okay, find clues. Off I go. Hey, yeah. Don't mind me. Just leave. Whoa! You lit yourself on fire. I didn't do it. It wasn't anything to do with me. Oh my gosh! All you have to do is stop, drop, and roll. Stop, drop, and roll. No! Oh my gosh! Oh, he lived. Okay, he did it. He did it. Okay, huh? good. Oh, wow. Don't stand so close to the fire. You set yourself on fire. Jeez, it's not that cold. <laughs> that was awesome. It's so funny when they set themselves on fire, which sounds like a terrible thing to say, but it really is. It's like, you're, you're an NPC. You're not supposed to do that. All right, hello, person. Did you see anything? No, nope. Oh. Not nothing. Oh. Far less than oh. anything. Oh. I see. So you saw something. Yes. Well, only if you count torches. But they uh -huh. crept up on me. They did. Must have been at least 30 of With them. With torches. Torches crept up Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if there were 30 of them, why isn't the ground stomped flat? <laughs> Those skin sandals, very soft. Don't leave a trace. Anyway, it's <laughs> hard to tell how many as I was uh, unconscious. Uh... Yeah, oh, let's try this. It's all right if you ran. Fear can change a man. I wasn't afraid. I was asleep. Oh, ah. I, I, mean, I won't tell. But did you see anything? No. Except... Yes? Some torches heading east. And you didn't investigate? I didn't want to leave my post. Uh -huh. But you'd already been robbed. If I deserted my post, I'd be charged with the reliction of duty. Then I'll let you get back to work. <laughs> Did they take everything? These crypts have been opened. There's no sign of forced entry. Hmm. All right, heading east. Aha. Hmm. A note. Take all that you can carry and meet me wow. at the ruins where we first consummated our love. Oh, wow. Soon we will be free. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, but now it's going to be one where it's like these two people got stolen from and they're kind of jerks. But if I, the person who stole from them was a, was a, somebody, two people trying to escape like slavery or something and I'm going to be the jerk. Who's gonna turn them in for money? Or the other problem is that if I don't pick it, figure out who it is, those two will probably break the truce, which is a big, which is a no-no. You know, we don't want that. The year in Ellis in the Valley of Olympia near this tree. They are hiding in the destroyed house of Oinimos. Or Oinomaus. Oinomaus. I guess. Anyway. I've heard talks of ruins outside the city. And from what the guard said, the torches were heading in that direction. East, east, east. Yeah. East, east, no, no. Just go here. Excuse me, excuse me. I'm probably going cross country, sort of. Apparently, I know they're hiding in a house, but you could just say they went east. <laughs> ah, it's not you two, is it? Okay, there's a third person. Wow, nope, okay. Coming close to my target. I found the thief. Because I have magical eyeballs that can see through my eagle. Are we going to have problems here? Is this going to be a problem thing? Ancient Stele. Cool. Alright, benefit of the doubt. You guys aren't going to attack me as soon as you see me. What up? Uh, 
I'm, I'm nervous. I hate these long screens. Makes me feel like it's gonna crash or something. So, thieves, I finally catch you. Please, we're not thieves! Yet here you are, with stolen goods. You don't oh. understand. This is rightfully ours. It's our inheritance. How can this all be yours? It belongs to our families. By blood, it's rightfully ours. If it's already yours, why not wait? Why steal everything now? We wanted a new life. One where we could be free and our love doesn't oh. have to hide in the shadows. So they're not like disinherited or like branch families. They're like probably the son and daughter of those two guys. Um, you know what I mean? Like from either one and yeah. Who are you exactly? They are my daughter. Whoa! This is how you repay me for raising you? By running off with some woman squirted from my loins? Whoa! Whoa! Why not put aside your feud, as your children have done? You're a mistress. Carry out your duty <gasps> and kill the thieves. No! I will pay you handsomely. Pater, no! I agree. I will match what? Bakar's price on this. Do what you were hired to do. I can't kill people once it gets the electric truce! your own son and yeah. daughter? Yeah! Also! We have other children. What? Now, are you a mistress or not? You're monsters! I will not slaughter innocents. Your families would stand a better chance for the future without the both of you. I'm not supposed to kill people, but it is what it is. Also, they're not really doing anything. I feel kind of bad, honestly. supposed to kill people but I did you guys better not have been lying to me I didn't want it to come to this but now we can forge a new future for our two families one built on love wow really you're gonna be like oh I wish you luck with that yeah cuz I'm the one who had to kill them you're welcome Wow, okay, anyway, quick, pay off my bounty. If I can, yeah. Bye. I mean, I didn't want to kill them, but like, I, I'm not gonna kill innocents either. Like, at least they seem like it, you know? And it was very a uh, Romeo, like sort of a Romeo and Juliet type thing where it's like a cross, like, <laughs> You know, the feuding families type thing, a political uh, commentary type thing, more than a romance. But maybe, maybe they will actually be successful now that they've gotten rid of the old hatreds. But, like, they they, they were as not concerned about killing their parents as their parents were about, about killing them. You know what I mean? That was a little weird. But, I mean, not weird. But, like, it was, it was absolutely terrible that the parents are like, oh yeah, we've got other kids, whatever, just kill these ones. I'm like, you can't really, you can't put aside your hatreds. They did, they put aside their hatreds for a second to say, kill our kids, you know what I mean? They like, came together as like, a force, like, oh yeah, we agree on this one thing, kill our children because they're trying to make us work together, even though we're working together now for you to kill, you know what I mean? Like, it was just, it was not, they were, they, those guys were dumb. They were dumb, and they, Really, those kind of people don't deserve to have nice things. <laughs> um, but, so hopefully the kids can do better with what they've got now. But Cassandra's the one who had to murder them and hope that the kids can do well with what they've been given. So anyway, that was interesting. So thank you all for joining me. I enjoyed I enjoyed those two those, those quests and running around with of Barbados was hilarious. Actually, he's so enthusiastic. I think he's funny. But thank you again, and I will see you in the next one.